but there is so much resistance and so much attachment to the world and to my yeah. <laughs> The world always takes you know, energy and commitment and time and dedication and it just it takes up a lot of, um, of your inner space. It's like you don't have time for your inner space. And your inner space is the most important because that is the thing that never really leaves you. And if we are not really, um, you know, giving attention to that, it's like life always seems like it's... <sighs> You know, even people sometimes in satsangs, they come and they, they, I see that they live very, very busy lives. And I understand that because most people in the world are like that. If they have to work, they've got a family and so on. But also, the minute you even start to sit, and even if the mind is boom, 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 don't try to stop it. Just let, just be aware of it, the mind and all these invitations and things to do and list and must do and do and just sit for a moment and just be aware of it but don't become too involved in it you know just be aware uh, and then somehow the attention moves away from the mind a little bit and just stay in a place where is no mind empty just empty no imagination just stop following your mind and sit like this Without, you know, do not to close your eyes, there's nothing to imagine. Just don't engage with the mind and remain just aware of just your being, not your personal self, just a feeling of existence in you. That's all. Just sit like this. You know, you know uh -huh. to say now? Yes. It's like so obvious, you know, it's so obvious. Yes, I know. And what happens is that until you do it, your mind will keep postponing it. It's as though the mind, it's as though the mind is afraid to do it. It's always trying to fill up something more, something. And I know it, it's very, very, because we're brought up like that. Everybody we see, example is like that. But the minute you just say, okay, you know what, just for a moment, I'm going to take, I'm going to take three minutes from my mind, just to sit by myself and let go of every shape, even though the mind is coming. Don't worry, don't try to stop it. But don't hold on to anything. Just like, you know, we were doing exercise here just now. And I said, I, my back is very tight. No? And I say, I rem in my mind, I just say, like, you're like a, like, a, like a stiff piece of paper, you know. And, and then you, you soak it in water or a piece of cloth and you soak it in the water and it gets soft. And just, just let it go. In the same way. Like I'm saying, the mind is boom, boom, boom. This, 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 this energy is there, but it's not you. The mind energy is not you. And what you do is you just somehow, you're aware of it. And I say, don't try to control your mind. L leave him for a moment. More recognize the space, which is not the mind, that the mind exists in. The mind plays in this boom, 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 boom. But the space here is not doing that. And it's not personal. So there's nothing to imagine. Just let go of every shape, of every intention, of time. Just, and you naturally come to a place of just being. And when you come to this place of being, uh, make the effort just to stay there. Don't get it connected with anything for a minute. And then in a very short time, you see the mind, the mind pull is not so strong anymore. It's kind of fading away. Just this, Liz. Just that. You do that. I am. I feel like I come. I meet you today for this, you know. And I think you know, no. Just this, you do for me. Okay. And if you do it in the morning, you get up. First thing in the morning, just five minutes. Sit with yourself. Five minutes, and just. And at lunchtime, sometime in the day, five minutes, just sit. And the evening before you go to bed, five minutes. You can spare that? Yes. <laughs> now, can you make a promise to me to do it? Yes. I even crossed the road. Yes. Yes. Very good. Make a promise to do that. Just sit. All I'm saying again, you just sit down. <sighs> okay. 
and you're aware of your mind, the energy in your body and mind. So, okay, especially if the mind is going, so sit. Whether it's going or not, sit. And just sit with this, the, the natural awareness of your existence. Just existing. No story, no identity, no intention, no desire. Just let go. Just leave them alone for a minute. Leave. And then all that's left is just the space of being. Just be. Not waiting. And of course, the energy of the mind sometimes come. Oh yeah, oh, I'm getting a bit restless and stuff. Don't pay attention to that. Because the restlessness or anything is just arising in the space that is not restless. It's peace. And be conscious of this space. Just take conscious of the space. Don't don't kind of uh, don't fade out and go into sleep or something. Just be conscious of the space, conscious, and see what happens afterwards. Hmm? You're going to feel that just that few moments spread throughout your day. Come lunchtime, sit again for a moment. You you give yourself the gift of five minutes in the morning, five minutes at lunchtime, and five minutes in the evening. Consciously do it. Simple thing. Just sit for five minutes. Start with just a few breaths. Okay. Now forget about the breath now. And whatever is going on in the mind, Every sensation, just be aware of them, but don't link up with anything at all. Just let them, just let them be there, doing their thing. But you are not that. You are the awareness of them. Just stay as the awareness, which is just a space. Just be aware, just of being. You know you exist before you think of anything. You exist. Just be with that basic "I exist" feeling, that existence feeling, and be conscious of it. And conscious when the thoughts come in, or when the phone rings, or when somebody, some thought come to contact someone. Be conscious of them, but don't log into them. Don't link with them. Just stay conscious, conscious. And you will start to feel within that five minutes just a slowing down of everything. And it's like you come back to just space. Space, no words, no pictures, just the space of being. And that space is the most important thing in all of your life. To be conscious of this space of being is the most important. And you are going to see it, actually. And then somehow you will see that when you have to come into your day, it's whatever you have to do in your day, you realize, wait a second, some things you thought you need to do, you don't have to do. You, you see it. it. It cleans everything. It cleans everything. cleans the mind and brings it into a stability. That's all. You want to take it on? Yes. Yes. I bless you today for this. I bless you today for this. I bless you today for this. And this is my instruction and guidance to you, to keep it up. You will do this? I am very, very happy. Yeah, I'm very, very happy for that. I feel that this is one of the best moments of this morning to meet you, you know? Because I know in, in my heart why you're here, you know? And that uh, things in life, it just comes, it just comes, you know, you get into a certain habit and it just goes like that. And you find less and less time for the real, real thing. And without you being centered here, it's like life takes your energy, it just takes your mind, takes your energy, takes your life also. So you you stay with this, huh? Yes. 